Okay, in this video, we're going to test the flaps, and so I'm going to zoom in on the on the um, deflection meter, which is sitting on the uh, right flap, and um, I want to see what the full flap is first. Okay, so that's down a full inch. So up, pull down the full inch. Now, I don't like to take off laps to be a half of that because sometimes a half is too much. Uh, but so that's a little more than a quarter. It looks like about five sixteenths. So I think I'd rather have that flap down a little bit more for the takeoff. So I'm going to change the flap system to where that um, position one is down to about three eighths. So let me select position one, lower it down to about three eighths, right about there. Okay. So um, that's probably an easy number to remember. Okay. So that's a minus, it went from minus 75, I'm sorry, from minus 100, which is flaps up, to minus 25. And that's. Uh, what I'm going to set for the takeoff flaps. Okay. And, uh, um, let me see, I don't see a recommendation for the flaps here. Uh, from the book, I don't see a flap recommendation. Um, but that's okay. I'll, uh, play it by how I like it when it takes off. So that's three eighths uh, for takeoff flaps and full flaps is down a full inch, which is basically the full throw of the aileron too. If I go full, full flap, full aileron down. No, actually it doesn't. Okay. You're right. Uh, Cause it was only like three quarters. Okay. So, uh, that's a pretty good flap setting for full flaps. It's going to slow it down and, and uh, do very nicely for one inch. Okay, uh, off camera I'll do the same thing and test it on the other side, but uh, because it's on a Y connector, I'm pretty sure they're going to be the same. Okay, one more point about the flaps. Um, I just tested the other side and it looked like it was off, but it really wasn't. When you try to use this um, device, Getting these things exactly in the same point on both sides of the wing is difficult. So uh, what might look like a, an, an eighth or even a little bit longer off is might be just because you have it at a different angle this way or that way and, and uh, not uh, exactly the same on both sides. Don't worry about that. Uh, if you want to measure the flaps, you, you can use a protractor to measure the angle maybe. Um, but what really is going to happen is um, when you do the maiden flight, you'll test the flaps at a high altitude. And as long as the um, airplane doesn't roll when you put the flaps down, everything's fine. If the, if the flaps do roll, uh, then I'll show you how to correct that. But uh, um, testing the other side is an approximation, not an exact science. 